Tank-busting armored vehicles are being sent from the United States to Ukraine, and President Vladimir Zelensky is quoted as saying that it's exactly what's needed to combat the Russian forces. The latest multi-billion dollar package of military assistance announced on Friday is the biggest to date, and for the first time, it includes Bradley armored vehicles. They are called tank killers because of the missiles they fire. In his nightly televised address on Friday, as his people prepared to celebrate yesterday's Orthodox Christmas, Ukraine's president called it a very powerful package. France and Germany have already agreed to provide light tanks to the Ukrainian forces, although their reluctance to supply main battle vehicles remains. The tank killers are a part of the latest $3 billion military aid package to come from the United States. And President Vladimir Zelensky is quoted as saying, quote, we will get Bradley armored vehicles. This is exactly what is needed. New guns and rounds, including high precision ones, new rockets and new drones. It is timely and strong, close quote. He went on to thank President Joe Biden, the United States lawmakers, and says, quote, all the American people who appreciate freedom and who know freedom is worth protecting, close quote. Last week, the Sunday Express revealed Russian commanders fear the U.S. deployment of Patriot missile batteries to knock out the ballistic missiles, describing them as a game changer. The escalation comes as both sides face an ongoing stalemate with Russian forces now embedded behind the river Nipro following their retreat from Kurzhan. As missiles continue to rain down on the beleaguered city, despite Russian leader Vladimir Putin calling a Christmas ceasefire, the war of attrition against Ukrainian infrastructure and Western resolve is all a part of the dictator's plan, this author of this piece states. <laughs> For headlines with a voice... This has been the Lockhart News Brief. Lockhart Perspective.